So now we're going to talk about an ismic spondylolisthesis. It's a mouthful, but it really is easy to understand. It is a fracture of the back of the vertebra, or the doorstop, as I call it, of the vertebra, when the child is anywhere between the ages of 8 and 15. It occurs sometimes on a football field. It might occur in a volleyball tournament. Anytime there's a lot of bending backward or a form of motion to the spine called extension. With extension, what happens here is a fracture of the pars interarticularis. And again, it's a lot of words, but what it means is that this area of the vertebra is fractured off. I call this piece the doorstop because it takes the vertebra above and hooks it into the vertebra below. The doorstop itself prevents the vertebra from sliding forward, so if you have a fracture of the doorstop, the vertebra can then actually start to slip forward. The area of the vertebra that is fractured is this piece right here. Again, simplistically calling it the doorstop, but this piece fractures off, and this is the piece in the back of the vertebra that hooks into the one below. This is what a normal vertebra looks like, and this is what the fracture looks like. And you can see that this piece is loose, where this piece is still solidly fixed. And this is the piece being loose that will allow the vertebra to slide forward. This is what the slip looks like with the fracture. You can see the fracture points here and here, and you can see that this vertebra here has slid off the sacrum here, and that slide is quite painful, sometimes pulling the nerves right in here away with it and causing pain in this nerve called the L5 nerve. 